To use the Hummingbird parenchyma, you must have an H100MR kit and an AirPulse AMS patient cable available. Connect the AirPulse AMS patient cable to the patient monitor before beginning the procedure, allowing the transducer to rise to an equilibrium temperature. Using a drill bit that comes with the kit, drill a hole with an approved surgical technique. Check the drill hole to ascertain that no sharp bone shards exist. Incise the dura. Use the drill bit centimeter markings to determine the thickness of the skull and select a bolt stop number that most closely matches the skull thickness. If the skull thickness falls between two bolt stop numbers, use the smaller numbered bolt stop. Slide the bolt stop onto the bolt assembly with the blue surface up. Hold the bolt stop on the bolt assembly and place in the twist drill hole. Advance and screw in. Stop advancing once the bolt stop provides resistance against the skull bone. Ensure that the scalp and surrounding tissues are not compressed underneath or around the bolt stop. Holding the support handle on the catheter, insert into the bolt assembly and press down on the support handle firmly until the catheter snaps into the bolt. Slide the support handle back on the catheter by pulling it up and onto the tubing. For instructions on ICP activation, please refer to Chapter 2. Disconnect the catheter's air pulse lure from the AMS lure. Turn the bolt assembly counterclockwise to remove it from the skull. Remove the bolt assembly and bolt stop from the site. 